Welcome to the Cohort 7 Unreal Engine Game Creation Competition. This one's a doozy, so buckle up, listen closely, and get ready to make some games. The first week starts off nice and slow. You start by downloading a basic template from the YTAC GitHub repository, but beware, this is no normal game. This is going to teach you hands-on how to make, fix, and playtest your own games. But if you get stuck, don't sweat. We have a few walkthrough videos guiding you on how to fix this template. Week 2 is where the party really starts. You'll be developing your own game using the template you fixed in the first week. You should make use of the pre-made blueprint classes that add basic functionality to the game. Change these up to really make it your own. Top three projects that show the most improvement over the base project by the end of the week will win that week's prize. Remember, you have seven days from Monday to Sunday. To submit your project, record a demonstration presentation, upload it to YouTube, and send it to Co. Keep it three to five minutes at most, and keep mature content out of it. You can use third-party assets in your games, such as character models and music, but you must specify what they are and where you got them. Keep in mind, you should make roughly 80% of everything yourself. The winner of week two has a special role. They certainly do. The winner of week two gets to share their project for week three. Whoa, what? Yes, sir. The winner of week two gets to share their project for week three, and everybody gets to iterate on the graphics. Add art, animations, sounds, and more to improve the game's visual appeal. The top three projects that are the most aesthetically pleasing will win from the prize pool. In addition to this, we have a very special creativity award for both weeks two and three that can earn you a little bit of extra moolah for your efforts. Now that you know what you're competing for, let's talk about those templates you'll be using. Feel free to take as much creative liberty as you please. The best place to start is to take an object we've already created and change its functionality. Great idea, Zach. The objects that we've included are a coin, a damage zone, a health boost, an instant death zone, and two power-up interactables. Fun stuff! In addition to the base game level, we've added a main menu and level transitions throughout. You are encouraged to add objects and mechanics to your game that we didn't include here. That's all you need to know for now. To learn more and to get started, watch our explanation and tutorial videos. You can find those in the Discord club. Don't hesitate to ask the club any questions you may have or ask for any help you need. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in, in the, the Unreal, Unreal Engine. Engine.